Hey guys, it's Tigger. Welcome to my first gear review. Today we're going to talk about the Hoka Evo Jaws. Uh, it's a pretty minimalist shoe. They come in at $130. Uh, they weigh, come in at 7.2 ounces, 3 millimeter heel to toe drop. And the only color they come in for men is the cyan and citrus color. They have a woven ripstop upper, moderately active foot frame, what they call their Pro Fly midsole, which gives a balance of. Uh, you get cushion for your heel impacts and a nice launch off the uh, the ball of your foot and your toes. It does have a Vibram Mega Grip uh, sole with six millimeter lugs, super cush, super grippy. I've got probably uh, 200 miles on these shoes, if not more. Uh, I've gone through every brand, well, not every brand, but close to it. I usually run Solomon's. <clears throat> I uh, talked to rep, got a pair of these, and uh, I can't look back. If they change anything, I want to buy three or four pair just to make sure I have them to run in. I'm not at all a fast runner, uh, but they have increased my time or decreased my time. Um, I've taken longest run I've taken them on. I did the uh, did an Xterra half marathon. Uh, felt great afterwards, no issues at all. There is no rock guard in them. It is all just soft. You see, very flexible shoe. Fold it in half. Super light, super crushed. The only thing I feel it, and other people I've, I've talked to that have worn them, the only thing you feel is the lace area on top of your foot and the sole of the shoe. It seems like there's nothing else on you. It's almost like wearing a pair of uh, super lightweight sandals and running in those. Uh, something like Bed Rocks or something like that. Uh, the only complaint that I've seen online and have talked to people is that the dye in the fabric bleeds off under your socks if you get wet or you sweat a lot. Uh, uh, see, that's a Hoka thing. Every pair of Hokas I've had does does that. Speed Goats, Cluftons. When your socks are in your shoes, who cares? I don't have any white socks anyways, so I really don't care if it bleeds onto my socks or not. I'm not going out in public with no shoes on, just socks. So I don't see why that's an actual complaint. Got me. But hey, if you're a heel, if you're a, a big heel drop runner, that's the only time I may not recommend these. They would probably be okay. Depends on how hard you hit and what you're running on. I hate to see you get like uh, bruises on your heel. Uh, for Hoka, they are a fairly narrow fit. I've got really skinny feet, uh, so that's why Salmon's work really good for me. Hoka's tend to be a little big, uh, but these these are awesome. Um, I don't want to run another pair of shoes. That's how much I like them. So that's my quick review on the Hoka Evo Jaws. Go ahead and get a pair. Try them out. Fantastic shoe. You'll love them.